Thank you again. It's no problem. It's no sweat, honestly. Sure. I'll get a date. <laughs> Look, let me uh, let me talk to you for a second, okay? Listen, I'm, I I don't mean to lump you in with Mike over there, you know, but I just feel like he's holding you back. You know when you put too much cream in your coffee and it doesn't taste like cream, doesn't taste like coffee, it just tastes like shit. Well, it's that's Mike. I'm so excited that that you're gonna be my brother. Huh? I'm so excited to be uh, your your brother. Brother. <laughs> Bro brother with an with an R on the end. Dude, you can be cool with me if you wanna like let loose. You can let loose. What? I know how to sea walk. Yeah. See, what is what is a sea walk? It's like. Okay. No, that, we won't be doing that. Just that kind of stop it. You like Kendrick Lamar? I, well, he's a he's a great artist. I, 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 I he's like. He's one his, of the best black rappers out there. He's well. Why, why say black rapper? He's just a rapper, isn't he? Yeah, but he's he's black. He's a black rapper. Would you call Frank Sinatra a white singer, or is he just like a singer? No, he's Sin he's Sinatra. Yeah. Dude, but... I love all black culture. Okay. What? I love it. Why are you saying this? Because you're black. Okay, that's what I thought. Yeah. If there's handshakes that you could teach me. I'm, I'm a little worried because at this wedding, about half of the guests are going to be black, and I'm kind of worried about Dude, things that you're going to say. I'm excited about that. Yeah, why, but yeah, but why? Why are you excited about that? Because the breakdancing, no, Wesley. See, that's not a reason. Dude, honestly, respect. Respect what, Mike? I want. I want you to do a thing called the. No, just a regular handshake. We're just gonna do one of these. Good. This isn't. Hmm. That's not fun. Well, yeah, it's just, it's just I could a do that with anyone. Yeah, and I'm anyone. You know what I mean? We'll be oh, dude, you're more than anyone. How so? You're Eric. Oh, my God, thank you, Mike. I'm, my I'm black sorry. brother. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, but. Yeah. Jimmy, we got to run real quick. <laughs> I got one thing to say. Fuck Dad. Right? I mean, I'm not gonna say fuck Dad. But you know what I will say? What? Not cool, Dad. Uh-uh. That is not cool. OK, I like my way better. What has Dad ever done for us? Hmm? He, like, raised us. Yeah, but besides that. Clothed us, fed us, he took us to our sports games. All those things were a long time ago, Dave. He just got you a really nice watch. Yeah, guess what, Dad? It's 2016. I got a motherfucking cell phone. OK? We're the brothers of the bride. That makes us, like, the coolest guys at the party. But now we got to tote around some some dates who we don't even know to our sister's wedding? Dave, what are you doing? I'm in the middle of a classic Mike rant over here. I'm just doodling, dude. That's actually pretty cool. It visually articulates what I was trying to say with my words, so. Yeah, see? Look, it's, it's us. Yeah. And then the two girls who, that we don't know who we're going to bring. See, it's a metaphor. What's the metaphor? The metaphor is these are us. Mm -hmm. And then these are the two girls that we don't know who we're going to bring yet. I don't think that's a metaphor. I think that's just exactly, literally, what you drew and literally what's happening. No, that's a metaphor. Honestly, sometimes I can't believe we're brothers. Besides the fact that we look 100% the same and people can't tell us apart, we are very different people. I've never heard anyone say that. People have said that. People said that once. Why are you so stressed out? So they want us to bring dates to the wedding. Why don't you just invite one of your ex-girlfriends? No can do. Why? I have burned a lot of bridges over the years, Dave. Bring Trudy. They hated Trudy. No, they don't. I hate Trudy. What about Lisa? Who is that? You dated her for like six months. Lisa. Yeah, no, I remember. Redhead. She was brunette. And that's why I can't invite her. I don't even remember who she is, Dave. Why don't you bring that girl from 4th of July? She won't talk to me after the Roman candle incident. What happened with the Roman candles? I burned her titty off, Dave. Oh, God. I gave her cauliflower tits. Dude, I don't know what to tell you. Jeannie said we need to find dates. So we got to find dates, OK? It's a big city. Perfect dates are out there somewhere, Dave. Yeah. I'm just gonna find them. Well, I'm gonna go take a shit. You know who you are. Who? Stella. From how Stella got a groove back? No. Yes. Angela Bassett's so regal. Her arms are so amazing. And I have always said you're like a Latina Whoopi Goldberg. I know, baby. And baby, I'm gonna get your groove back. I don't, I don't think Just I can. Whisper uh, it. Hey, whisper you're gonna get your groove back. I'm gonna get my groove back. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you say a little louder? Because I couldn't hear you. I'm gonna get my groove back. 
I'm sorry, what'd you say? Can you just say it one more time? Oh, I just was saying that I was gonna get my groove back. Yes, you are. Starting right now! Ah! You didn't drink. I don't, just at weddings. Aha, thank you. Cheers. Yeah. Oh, hot. Hot and spicy. Uh, can we get two more, please? Extra spicy. Oh. Oh, he loves it. Woo. Oh my god, they kind of sneak up on you, don't they? The oh, second man. one's gonna be a lot easier for you. Mm. Is your mouth, but okay. Uh, I feel like I'm tonguing a jalapeno. Mm. Good night, my sweet prince. I left you a barf bucket and some water because I love you. But now, daddy's gotta make a call. A call of the booty variety. Booty variety. It's a good joke. smoking weed? No. Uh, this is an eating apple. It's for eating. Huh. That's, um, okay. Uh, actually, your room is on my credit card. Did you guys happen to order a movie last night called Deep Dick Pizza? No. What would that even be about? Like a failing pizzeria that has to become a male brothel and instead of a rolling pin, the chef has to use his dick? Yeah, that sounds like exactly what it'd be about. Yeah, no, I haven't seen it. That is weird that you know so many specific details about a movie that you've never seen. I think I saw a review in The Times. Yeah, I just wanted to see if it was a mistake or not. Got you. Hey, Bocce starts in 20 minutes, so get ready for that. Are we excited? We're, We're so, so excited. excited. I will see you guys at the Bocce Off. <laughs> Has it been 20 minutes? Show it to the people. Okay, please don't touch the trophy. Only winners get to touch the trophy. So you can touch it if you win. Those are just the rules that have been set in place for 11 years now. All right, when you do dildos, they're on 69, and can we uh, see those uniforms? What are you talking about? Every year you hold this tournament, every year you guys have some lame homemade uniform. Oh, you must mean these uniforms. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Somebody better call a vet, because these puppies are sick. I gotta admit, the craftsmanship is impressive. Bocce balls is right. All right, looks like first up we got Dave and myself against our esteemed guests, Tatiana and Alice. <sighs> I don't know how long Tatiana, Alice. Damn. Sorry we have to beat you. It's, it's nothing personal. It's just even if we tried, we literally couldn't lose. Yeah. It's like a switch. Once the light turns on, it just doesn't turn off. We're that good. <laughs> Remember what I said? Fuck that. Let's kick these guys in the dick. Fuck yeah. You know how locked in I get when I'm blazed. I am... Blazed? All right. <laughs> Let's do this. Yeah. 
Hey, we like these girls. Should we take it easy on them? Absolutely not. We should let them lose with dignity, which is what I'd like to think we would do. They've got total bocce bots. We, we overlooked that. Look at this. Nothing is beautiful anymore. They made us look like losers. Losers! Did you see the way they gloated after they won? That's bush league. They're supposed to be, they're supposed to be making us look cool. I'm beating us at Pachi. Wait till Jeannie's rehearsal dinner. When we give our speech, they're gonna see who the real winners are. Yes. Yes, up next, swimming with dolphins. Mm -hmm. Tatiana will see me swimming with those majestic creatures and she'll probably wanna put her mouth all over my blowhole. I would. What? If you were a dolphin? I don't think you get what I'm saying. You would? What is that? Investigate. defacing our bocce trophy, and embarrassing us big time in front of our family? Guess what? We do that on our own. We don't need your help, ladies. You know what the worst part is? Do you even want to know what the worst part is, Dave? What? Zero physical contact. Even married people have sex at weddings, Dave. Married people. You smell the sex. Missionary. Doggy style. Reverse cowgirl. That's just our dirty clothes. Mike, I know you normally run hot, but you are overheating right now. I'm a sexual rocket ship, and I am ready to blast off to the sex moon. Do you even know what gravity's like on the sex moon? Do you even know the moves that I could have been pulling? Where I'm just, I'm just holding the ground like this, and I'm pushing away. Are you following me about the sex moon? Yeah, yeah, I'm following you. Because uh, I feel like I'm talking about sex moons and you're not following. No, I follow you, I follow you. This truly is 50 shades of fucked up. What are you saying? What, what were your expectations for this? Like, what honestly did you expect to get out of this weekend? I expected us to wear terry cloth robes and feed each other fruits and, and, and bathe each other in, in Turkish baths. What's a Turkish bath? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I expected to learn on this trip. I expected to go home and tell my friends I was in a Turkish bath all weekend long. What did you do? How's PS4 treating you, Derek? I fucking hate Derek. He's no longer my friend. I thought it was gonna be sexual fireworks. I thought it was gonna see some stuff I've never even seen before, like stuff that's normal in Japan. But you can't even talk about it here. Mm -mm. Just think of the big picture here. Remember, we're doing this for Jeannie. I wanted this to be something special for me also, Dave. She's really in my head, Dave. I don't know, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I think the boob walls have spread to my brain. I can't even think anymore. I got blue brain. I got blue brain. It's gonna be okay. No, it's not. Come on. I wanna see that smile. No. I wanna see those Mikey dimples. Come on. Let me bring them out. Dimples activated. There it is. Dink, dink. Now say it. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Right? Yeah, it's gonna be cool. Just don't tell mom I said any of that stuff. I'm not gonna she's... tell anyone about this conversation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're gonna hit me. <laughs> Here's just a thought. If Tatiana matters that much to you, you know, how about you just go and talk to her? You mean like, 
Like right now? Yeah, we're think about what you're gonna say. Tatiana! You are clearly on drugs, and we get married tomorrow. I'm joking hard. Yes. <laughs> Drink some water. I don't know. What the hell were you two doing out there, huh? Spent 30 grand on that rehearsal dinner and it turned into a UFC steel cage grudge match. Sick ref, Bert. I'm a huge UFC fan. Ah. Chuck Liddell, right? Uh huh. The Iceman. Love Liddell. Me too. Not, not the time. You know what chaps my ass? I didn't get to finish my speech. Because you're dumbass sons. My apologies, Bert, but I believe that you already know that they are dumbasses. Yeah, I'm painfully aware. Yeah. yeah. I would like to assuage the situation, Dad. Swage. I would like to do that to this situation and apologize to you. A lot of the things that happened this weekend are all my fault. Mm -hmm. And I would like to take full responsibility for those specific things that were my fault. OK. So are you going to say it now? What? That you're proud of me? Oh, my god. What? Now, you want me to say I'm proud of you just, right now? Yeah, yeah, because I just apologize. <laughs> Stick. The worst time to ask this. Say that you're proud of me. Be the bigger man, Dad. Be the bigger man. Just say it. Be the bigger man, Dad. Stop talking. Just be the bigger. Stop talking. I was messing with him, and that makes me feel terrible. I don't want to do that. Tatiana, hi. I'm your Uber. You ready to go to the airport? You know what, Raul? I didn't order you. The old Tatiana ordered you. All right. Well, I hope the new Tatiana has the same gold credit card. Yeah, well, the old Tatiana stole that credit card from a DJ. Wow. Don't pull up in an Uber and wow me. Wow. It's off, Raul. Wow. I'm within my five-minute cancellation window. Freaking Holly. I don't speak Hawaiian. I don't speak crazy. All right, fuck you, man. I was trying to empathize. Fuck you. This ain't gonna be good for your customer ratings, I can tell you that. One star, Raul. No. Mahalo. Mahalo. Yeah. <laughs> you got a good kid out there. Yeah, I know. No, really, he's awesome. I know it's not my place to say this, but um, maybe you could tell him sometime. <laughs> oh, you don't know Mike. He didn't care what I think. He never has. Come on, he cares. Mm. Everyone wants approval from their dad. Mm -hmm. I bet you wanted that from your dad. Yeah, but I never got it. On the day he died, I told him, I love you, Dad. He said, I think there's a leak in the garage. That sucks. Yeah. I know this may surprise you, but my family's pretty messed up. That doesn't surprise me one little bit. Really? No. <laughs> well, your family's cool. Thank you. You guys are totally insane, but <laughs> lovely. Thank and I've never used that word before. Well, I, I, I appreciate you saying it. Yeah. <laughs> Ah! <coughs> oh, that got stuck in the pipe. For Jeannie. Everyone got stuck. Cheers. Cheers, dude. Gotta hand it to you, too. You pulled it off. Granted, you were the ones that messed everything up in the first place, but still, nice job. Thanks. <laughs> well, listen, we just really want to say we're sorry for everything. For this weekend, for the trouble we caused. We can't have been easy to raise. We've been so bad for so long. And so bad. We didn't even realize how bad we've been. So I just want to say that I am so sorry. What did you say? I said I'm, I'm sorry. Huh? Dad, are you having a heart attack? What? Honey, look at me. What's your name, Bert? 
Did yeah. you have peanuts? Uh, Is there peanuts there? Uh, hey, who's got the EpiPen? No, it's all right. It's fine. Oh. I just. I like it. I can't tell you guys how much that means to me. Are you proud of us? I'm proud of you. Thanks. Thank you. I just want to hear that. Let me see that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know we well, well, well. That's what it's like in this family. Ugh. Get a room. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Terry. Oh. <laughs> That was way over the top. I have never respected you more. <sighs> Looks like I kind of got what I deserved. Stengels? That was awesome! <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> <laughs> it got air! We understand. I mean, your dad and I, well, you know, back in the day, we were sometimes idiots. Yeah, just like us. Yeah. I like to talk about it, but. Uh... I mean, we sometimes are cruising bars, mm -hmm. looking for other couples. Yeah. Into the same action we're into. Mm -hmm. yeah. are, you are you talking about like, uh, like sex stuff? Yeah, Dave. We are talking about sex stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah. that was enough. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's enough. yeah. Moving on. I, I really want to say something, actually. Mm -hmm. I, I, um, I just want to say sorry for everything. What are you doing here? I like to watch things. stuff? My butt, your butt. Oh, I, I thought it was both. <laughs> it is both. At the same time. <sighs> Every woman is born with a thousand orgasms trapped inside her. And releasing that energy is her gift to the universe. Uh, oh, baby! Oh, no, there's no touch. I touch. You don't touch. <laughs> 